On the road, on the road, I'm on the road, yes, I'm on the road. Good morning everybody, today's going to be a great day, do you know why? Because it is Friday the 10th of October and I don't have any classes today because I'm going on an excursion. Huzzah! <coughs> I'm off to <coughs> so much flam. I'm off to see Black Diggers, um, which for anyone who doesn't know what Black Diggers is about, <coughs> it is a uh, play about the involvement and importance. It's kind of like the untold story or hidden story, I guess you could say, of Indigenous Australians during the First World War and at Gallipoli. And it's one of those uh, one of those subjects that was kind of at the time just pushed under the rug. Like these these individuals, uh, indi uh, indigenous individuals, <coughs> at the time of the First World War in Australia had little to no rights. They had the worst rights whatsoever. Um, basic human rights were not afforded to them, and that is a horrible thing. And yet they still. Uh, signed up and went to war to defend this country. There was just over a thousand of them, I think, Australian uh, individuals, indigenous individuals, who went with the rest of the Australian population to defend this country. And when they got back, all the land rights, all the entitlements that other soldiers were entitled to, these indigenous individuals received none of whatsoever so it's it's a story that needs to be told I'm very excited for it because I believe that theatre should always have a point um, theatre should always educate the audience on something um, so and this this production of Black Diggers well this is the original production of Black Diggers the only one um, is getting rave reviews all over the place so I'm really excited to see this so I'm seeing this with my year 11 and 12 drama students today so that's the thing I'm <laughs> um, 40 kilometers uh, from school I need to be there at 8 o'clock I don't know how I'm going on the time actually it is uh, 6 56 um, so probably at 7 I'm gonna say 7 30 I think I will get there Hopefully, I was. I'm aiming to get there between 7:30 and 7:45 because I think all the students are going at 7:45 because we're leaving right on 8 o'clock. And then it's a lovely trip to Brisbane. I hate travelling on buses. I really do. It just annoys me. Uh, okay, I will try and vlog this afternoon on the drive home, but we're not getting back to school till about 6 o'clock or just after, so might not be happening. Might have to vlog when I get home. I'm not sure. Either way, I will see you guys later, and I'll let you know what I thought of Black Diggers. So, as I knew would happen, I didn't get any time to vlog on the way home from school today, mainly because it was dark and you wouldn't be able to see anything, but... All I have to say about today is, if you have the chance to see Black Diggers, I'm not quite sure when it finishes. Um, doesn't say. If you have the chance to see Black Diggers, dear gods, go and see it. It is one of the greatest pieces of theatre I have seen. It is, to me, it is like the perfect um, mix of... Brechtian theatre and like a couple of other little things. It's mainly very Brechtian. The whole thing is very Brechtian. It's very didactic. It's there to educate and inform people of this story. Um, it's kind of like Brechtian meets verbatim meets um, kind of political. Not really political, but it's it's just amazing. It's a really good theatre, so if you have the chance, go and see that. Um, 
it was just an amazing story. It's amazing directing. Um, everything about it, the themes, um, the manipulation. <laughs> I'm going to, I, I'm mainly going to say this, the manipulation of um, dramatic languages, mainly because that's what I was thinking of the whole time because I need to write a responding task for, for year 11 students and uh, send off to verification board. But yeah, it is an amazing piece of Australian theatre that tells, you know, the kind of the, the, the story of Indigenous Australians who had very little rights at the time. It's just that whole sweeping under the rug or having white, um, just literally whitewashing, for lack of a better word, whitewashing out this history and what these people did for Australia and how they received little to no um, acknowledgement of this whatsoever. So it was an absolutely amazing performance. So it is by the Queensland Theatre Company? Yeah, Queensland Theatre Company and Brisbane, um, um, Brisbane Festival Association, I don't know, but it is good, so everyone should go and see it. I don't know if I've mentioned before, but Bundy looks really weird now that we've shaved up. You look tiny. It makes you look really small. Yes, we're talking about you now. I I hope. <laughs> anyway, um, also I just watched the new episode of American Horror Freak Show, and it is great. If you, if I didn't have a fear of clowns already, most definitely do now. Um, but it is good. Everyone should go watch that as well. I was going to watch the new Arrow, but I've realised somewhere along the way I've missed a lot of episodes. Like, it's like previously on Arrow, I'm like, I don't remember any of this happening. So I've missed something along the way. Anyway, I will sign off now, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Basically this weekend, there probably won't be that much of vlogging, mainly because I have a lot of lesson plan writing to do and unit plans. Ideally, I'd like to get all my resources, and teaching material, and lesson plans for the next week, this weekend. We'll see how it goes. Peace, guys.